Hello guys and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Kalechi. For those of you that might just be coming to my YouTube channel for the first time. So today I'm going to be showing you how I created this design. I've created the design um, a while ago and I think some persons asked for this tutorial and I've not been able to do it. So today is a lucky day and it's a quite simple design but let me just show you how. So you can know how to do it in case you want to attempt now this is the design it's like i said it's quite simple but if i don't show you how you won't know now some of these images some were downloaded from external website some i got from canva now let's start with the background i think this was got in this particular one was an external website so the background the background i saved it where did i save it save it I think was this that okay yep this is it so as you can see all these ones we are gotten from this one we got from canva canva then it did this sorry no 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 so let's start with this is our blank page now I'm going to drag this here Okay, this is it. Let me see if I'm correct. Yep. So now, um, I, I just did, I edited this particular image. Okay. I used the blow. I just did it. And um, blow was, I think, 10. Yep. Yes, yeah, that's it. So this is it, blow. And then, um, this water, I think, was gotten from... I downloaded it from an external website where or not. So I'm just going to copy this one and paste it. It just came like that. I downloaded it from um, cleanpng.com in case you want to um, try that. And the no effect was applied. That is just the way it came. And this is it here. So no effect was applied. This is the water image. This is the background. And now this bicycle image here um, was gotten from an external website too. So um, I would have just um, dragged this. Okay. I just placed it here. But to make sure that it's on the exact same spot as it is with this particular one, I'm going to click on copy and I'm going to paste it here. So this is it. Now he's riding on air. <laughs> wow, that's weird. So um, next thing I did was create this particular image. It's a leaf image. You can find it on Canva. Okay, on that photo, just search for leaf, and um, you would see it. So I'm going to bring it here, paste it, and take it all the way to the back. It comes with um, uh, the leaf image comes with. A shadow okay I drop down shadow so so you can see it you can see it comes with a shadow so we are almost there now the next thing I did was um I applied a shadow okay apply the shadow Oops. place it here this is a drop down shadow. Duplicate it and take it all the way here. Show it in the middle. Place it here. It's not that visible. Yes, I know, but that's the plan. So we have our guy riding. Now let's finish with this guy here. The next thing I did was. Um, cry this leaf, copy it, and paste it here. This leaf too was not gotten from Canva, it was gotten from an external website. Okay, do the same here, copy it, and paste it here. So it's quite easy, so I'll save time. And as you can see, no effect was applied on this um, images. You can see no effect, no effect whatsoever, no effect whatsoever. But for this image, I applied the afterglow effect, which is 
the afterglow filter effect which is this and that's why you can see brightness 15 contrast 19 saturation minus 12 that's because i applied the afterglow effect that's why it's shiny now the next thing um the other thing i did was this image this image the image of um that looks like a whirlwind okay paste it here take it to the back okay now that particular image let me just show you how this particular image on um, the transparency was minus 43 okay so it doesn't really um bring it doesn't really affect the design so you can just see it there in the background it's visible but not that visible okay so that's the whole point why i reduce the transparency i'm going to take it back to 43 and bring this here yeah so we have gotten this one yes we've gotten this image now um the next thing i did was where is it where is it where is it where is it it's under start so it's under start and this particular image flip it bring it here turn it like this and then we have something like this so this is the image making it look like um it's a it's a rock or a mountain whatever so this is it this image was not gotten from canva i downloaded it from an external website i think but you can also try that uh, most of the png images i download i downloaded from cleanpng.com and just use it to create designs um most not for business just um practice purposes so the last thing okay the second to the last thing here was this image the image of a crow so i'm going to copy this i reduce the size so it can fit in yep it's there this is the image original image i have to flip it horizontally and reduce the size so it can fit in here and just rhyme so the crow doesn't look bigger than the main image here okay and the last thing i did was um our dolphin here okay this this dolphin image too was gotten from cleanpng.com like i said this design was created a long time ago and paste it here take it to the back so yes it's co it's covering that it's covering the water okay the water coming out from the dolphins the bottom part of the dolphin so we are done with this particular design the last thing i'm going to do is just copy this text here i pretty much did copy and paste copy and paste copy and paste because i told you it's a, um, a simple design and you too can attempt something like this if you want the image um you just let me know i can send it over to you if you want to attempt something like this anything is possible if you believe okay if you notice this particular design or um image it's um something extraordinary something out of the ordinary okay so that is the reason for this caption it's small because i didn't want it to um distract people from seeing the main uh, manipulation here so that's pretty much how i came across that's pretty much how i did this design background i reduced the blur i increased the blur to 10 and pretty much all these images um i just applied it to create this manipulation the leaf the image the man on the, on the bicycle um this leaf here got it from canva which comes with a shadow so i didn't have to place a drop down shadow behind the leaf it just came like that and then the wind so it looks like um it's what's pushing the image and then we have um this water here just to make it look much more presentable and then we have a um, rock and a crow and that is it please do not forget to subscribe i'm going to be sharing more tutorials thank you and stay blessed